Hello MTV! Welcome to my crib, it's me, Plastic Gats, the 3D printed gun guy, you know. What are we doing today? As you can see, we got this little goober running right here, just, yeah, just pan over that. So yeah, we got him printing, and as you can tell... Yeah, that's pretty loud. Um, I don't like that, because sometimes I print things that take a long time, and... In that long time, I have to sleep. No, no, I'm back over here. No, don't think that. We're hiding all the... <laughs> That's where I put all the mess. So, why do you think the room looks so clean? Anyways, so basically, I have had this freaking thing right here. It's a silent main board for that printer over there, the Ender 3. We're going to put this goober in there, and we're just going to uh, get it to work, hopefully, so that I can sleep without hearing all right let's uh let's get to it uh, so i'm not sure which ones we're gonna need all right <sighs> yeah this thing's a mess i've been meaning to do some like cable management over here stuff like that poor gas uh, only has one guide screw Psh, i only need one guide screw you're just not cool enough to have two. <laughs> Why would I need? I only need, dude. That is, oh, that's so dumb. So, um, I built a. So my friend printed a uh, a Glock 19 build, and uh, what was it? I, I I put it together for them, and I even they even gave me money for the build to go get them some more mags, right? And those mags, I believe, hold like. 14 plus one right and so i was like i i, I saw him next time the next time i saw him i was like hey how's that glock doing or whatever he's like oh, i was doing pretty good and then he he told me long story short i found out he only puts eight rounds in those magazines i'm like why you know they hold 14 right and then he said the thing that just he's got the most look i love him to death but he's got the most like fud mentality he's like well, if I'm ever in a position where I need more than eight, then, you know, I got bigger things to worry about. It's like, dude, shut up. You got, you got eight rounds. He, freaking, I hate that mentality so much. Where's the other screw at? Hold on. Before we do anything, I'm going to take a picture of this hoe. Boom. So then there's like a big cable and then like a small cable. <gasps> Where's it at? Okay, cool. This is this is the yeah, one that doesn't have the hot your, glue on all it. All of your models? No, it is. It's on what? this side. Ah, frick! God, these are hot glue. Great. <clears throat> to get that off. Actually, I have a better idea. Uh, we have technology. <clears throat> there we go. That's a, that's a little bit better. So, we're going to have to label... Um... No, you don't have to label them. I know where they go. Are you sure? Yeah. These are literally the same exact cables. So. Yeah, no, it's good. Why don't we just mark, why don't we just put a little, right, or a dot on whichever one goes on the left? For my sake of mind? I mean, if you want to. I'm going to do Your that. markers right there. So it is. So this one is the one that goes on the left. We got to use the screwdriver to get those screws out, but I don't have the screwdriver. Yeah, that'll work. I hope. Ah. Let's hope. Hey, looky there. Let's go. Cameron Gats for the win. Cameron. Cameron Gats. You know, I was watching a video about how to do this just in preparation mm -hmm. for this. And they said, don't break the torque with the uh, the round side. And I was like, shh. Bro, you know who you're talking to? You're talk <laughs> Probably talking to like a wider yeah. audience, but that's why I didn't watch a video to do mine. I just did. You know who you're talking to? You're talking to Ishmael Anthony Gatz. Got it. Ugh. You know, I, I realized that maybe building this on carpet probably wasn't the best idea, but <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh yeah, there we go, and all of her maiden shine of goodness. Uh, you know, it's kind of scary to think that if something like really, really, really bad goes wrong, that that this printer is basically just done. It's just done, so until I can fix it. Would so you like me to do your wires, or are you wanting to do this yourself? I'll do it myself. You want to be a big boy? Yes, I want to be be a big boy. <laughs> <laughs> Did we 
tell you about that? I, I, I <laughs> you've been saying it like a lot, and I just kind of, just kind of stuck. I was about to say. So, <laughs> did we tell you about the? Yes, Yes, I gotta tell you that. I gotta tell you that story. Whatever you say, <laughs> what the bridge of the Obama. <laughs> <laughs> but basically, the joke is that Michelle Obama was this giant. Orcish oh, okay. I thought monstrosity. It was, okay, I thought we were. I thought the joke was for like Biden or something. No, 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 no. It was um. So ba- <laughs> so basically, the joke is <laughs> Michelle Obama was this like giant hulking orcish creature, and <laughs> she just like stood by uh, Barack Obama when he's playing Call of Duty, and then Barack Obama goes, uh, "Michelle, uh, this kid got a kill streak on me." Uh, draft him, and then he, and then she goes, and then she like reaches through the TV, grabs the kid on the other side, and just flings him into Iraq. <laughs> <laughs> and then he goes, Obama. but the the joke is also that Michelle Obama is just like using Barack Obama as this like power power ploy, and um, <laughs> she's she's using Barack Obama for her her ultimate her, her ultimate goal. Uh, Michelle, uh, can you install the silent motherboard uh, for my 3D printer? Yes, I'm a uh, Thank you, Michelle. You're welcome, Obama. Yes. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, smart boy gang. Look at that. Whatever you say, Obama. <laughs> UK MFs be like, Oi, mate, are you going to be watching Dragon Ball Z? E gate sports. It's in the gate. Mojang cable, Mojang cable. The smelly gay baby. Cable. The smelly gay baby cable. They don't understand what I'm saying. Rip to all the smelly gay babies out there. <laughs> Rip to potential monetization. <laughs> smelly gay babies. Now that we got the smelly stuff out of the way, we actually skipped a lot of the stuff that we did. Um, basically, we just put this back on and everything's good. So now what we gotta do is we gotta flash the SD card that we're gonna put in there. So we went to Creality's home website, Creality 3D Official. So now what we gotta do, we go to, what was it, About Creality. Yeah, so go to About a Creality, Firmware Download, and then we, s Ender Series, okay? Click that. Then it should take you to this one right here. We went to, this one here and then this is the VL touch so you want to click this one awesome and that's the right one boom <clears throat> so what we've gone ahead and done is this little doodad this little micro SD card reader that comes with it we plug that in and then we got the micro SD card in there so what we're gonna do is we're gonna move this we've already downloaded this we just thought we would do a little reenactment for the video and so we're gonna go here and we're gonna drag it to that micro SD card. And if we check, boom, it's on there. So this is about as far as we got before we decided to record this. So pull that out. I'll just get up over here. So we're gonna go ahead and plug that in. And also speaking of plugging things in, we gotta plug this bad boy in. Ah, there we go. Now let's see if she blows up. Oh, is that it? That's it for uh, install. Now you have to test it. All right, that sounds good to me. Let's uh, huh. ah, plug her back in. Boom. Handy dandy thing that you can do with Octoprint. Yeah. You no longer need to move this from machine to machine. Well, I'm a filthy plebeian. Also, if you're wondering why I'm wearing these headphones, it's so I can monitor my uh, little microphone here. What? Now, hold on. I know, I know daggum well that that thing ain't working that way. What? There's... That's crazy, though. That is crazy. That's ridiculous. I'm mesmerized by that. For all you safety dorks out there that, you know, didn't like this little bit that we were doing. Uh, yeah, no, we took all the, took the bolt carrier out for you safety goons. Bro, imagine caring about safety. <laughs> the only thing more sad than caring about safety that I can think of is probably <laughs> majoring 
in occupational safety and health. Bro, can you imagine, bro? Uh, I can't. I'm so glad that I don't major in occupational safety and health in college. Kiss your homies. Good night. Have a good one.